I invite you to open the doors to a life of simplicity and intention, a life of minimalism. What is minimalism? It's about cutting back to the essentials, finding joy in fewer things, and creating space not just in our closets but in our lives. Let us talk about where this journey begins, your personal space. Look at your wardrobe. Those clothes you never wear are more than just fabric. They are reminders of a past self, of money spent, and space taken. Let us free ourselves from the weight of unused garments. Sell them, gift them, but let them serve a purpose elsewhere. I have a separate material somewhere in my social media properties, Arman Benko in YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram, that discusses further decluttering our wardrobe. Shoes. Why keep those that pinch our toes and burden our steps? I am very guilty of acquiring too much, way too much shoes. I have now decided to choose comfort and joy in every step by parting with shoes that no longer serve me. Consider your makeup and toiletries. I used to justify hoarding because of regular weekly TV guestings. We all have those items we bought for a special occasion, now collecting dust. Let's be honest with ourselves and keep only what we use, probably giving and sharing the rest with someone who can appreciate them. Don't forget that desk drawer. It's not just a drawer but a reflection of our daily working life. By organizing it, we're setting ourselves up for a more productive and less stressful workday. Oh, and those cords and cables. How many do we keep just in case? Let's clear out the tangle of the just in cases and keep only what we truly need. Lastly, our books. They are vessels of knowledge and joy. But let's pass on the stories to new readers if they no longer serve us. This decluttering is not just about making space, it's about making choices. It's about deciding what's important and allowing ourselves the freedom to live, to breathe, and to think more clearly. So as we approach the new year, let's not just think about resolutions that may fade. Let's commit to actions that will transform. Let's embrace minimalism, starting with the personal spaces we live in every day.